The Muskegon County Road Commission completed preparations today for whatever the weekend storm may bring to the community. And that includes adding chains to the tires of some snow plows, something that hasn't been done in years. 13 on your side's John Mills has more now from the Lakeshore. Friday's temperature in the mid 40s made it a perfect day to prepare for the big storm. 44 degrees and hardly a cloud in the sky. Drivers had sun visors down. Tomorrow, their windshield wipers will be put to the test. These pleasant conditions must be the calm before the storm. It's just amazing. Perfect for outdoor chores and working without a jacket. Perfect to walk and just enjoy. But the weather will turn. I don't like the ice. A winter storm warning begins in Muskegon County at 10 p.m. If it gets bad, we'll call in all the troops. The Muskegon County Road Commission is ready for snow, ice, or a mixture of both. We expect the worst and hope for the best. Andrew Nichols says the best would be snow. If it's ice, trucks with tire chains will be used to spread salt and sand. The trucks with the chains on them, they're going to be going about 20, 25 miles an hour. That'd be the max speed. We don't want to tear up the roads. Power lines encased in ice is the top concern for consumers energy. We are in the process of positioning our crews uh, so that we are ready to go. We think we're going to start getting outages Saturday morning maybe midday Saturday, depending on the weather. Roger Morgenstern says restoration times will be impacted by the weather, especially if it's ice forming instead of snow falling. We appreciate our customers' patience because um, the safety of our crews is number one, and so they may not be able to get out right away. If you can get your stuff done today, it's a good choice. If you don't have to go anywhere, stay home this weekend. And emergency managers tell me before the storm fully charge any electronic devices you rely on, have fresh batteries for your flashlights, and have on hand enough food, water, and medication to last you for at least 72 hours. In Muskegon County, John Mills, 39 on your side.